Today, we're gonna be starting on the Miata lip, but first thing for today, we're gonna go and take the Jeep, wash it up before I get its first oil change. One more thing before we leave, I also bought wheels for this thing. I know there's not really anything to this car, and I already bought wheels, but I just got a super good deal on some wheels, and uh, can't wait for those. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing washed out. Disgusting. Oh my God, dude, that's a lot of bugs. That's like a shit ton of bugs. Never? Oh shit. Why would I have someone else do it? I mean, I've. The, the only reason I'm not doing it now is because they're free. True. So. For how long? Just, they only give you a certain amount of time. Oh, okay. I think I only got like three. It's kind of bullshit. It's one of my friends got like 15 or something like that. Anyways, now we're off to Dodge and the little change. Still dirty on the inside. George is picking up his car right now, so that way he can take me back here once we drop off the car. Uh, they said it's about a two hour wait for an oil change, and that's a little bit too long for me to be waiting. So we're probably just gonna head back here and get some work done meanwhile. So we're back. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and start on the Miata lip. I got the Jeep all uh, washed up and got the oil changed. And so we're gonna go ahead and start on this. I got the template right there. It should be pretty easy. First thing, I'm gonna start cutting the square tubing, start building the frame. I doubt we'll get to any of uh, the sheet metal today, but uh, hopefully we at least get that main part built out. All okay. right, so if we could move the Mustang just over there, push this thing out, and then that way we can bring this front end out and then be able to work in the front. Zip strip into the, so it doesn't fall. Is there a special significance to? No. No. My dad gave it to me. Oh, okay. So. While I was like, no, 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 not like that. No, you literally like uh, one day I was just driving away and he found it or something. He just oh. Me and put it in the car. He literally put it right there and I was like, okay, and it's literally just stayed in here ever since. It's been there like probably since like the first week I bought this thing, which is like almost three years ago now. Can you help me? I basically just want to measure <clears throat> like here, okay. all the way on the edge, right there. Okay. And then on the same exact point on the other side. So just. Okay, well, yeah. Is it good? Uh, yes. So the radiator hangs down like, or it's like right, like it's basically flush with this bottom piece here. So I'm just gonna have one long piece across the bottom and then build the sides up 
and then have the triangle down to the just the half inch square tubing at the end. So it's basically going to look thicker at the, this end. Oh, okay. And then, but I don't have to do, I was going to do two runners, so basically it was almost going to uh, be like a box, but then because of the radiator being in the way, I'm just going to uh, not use one on the top. And it'll still be perfectly structurally like sound, but this way it won't have any air interference with the radiator, especially if it does hit anything, because otherwise it might go right up into the radiator. And the bottom of the radiator is all plastic, so. Definitely want to avoid that. Definitely appears to be wider on a car than it does, like. Ah, that's fine. Okay. Ow, that one hurt. All I needed is one that was longer than those. I have one that's long enough. Son of a bitch. Wow. Well, I mean, it's not like you have a welder where you could weld yeah, two of those weird. together. It's not like you don't know how to weld. Well, I don't know how to weld. I'm sure most of the people in the comments in the last video told me I don't know how to weld. You think so? Oh, absolutely. Whatever. It's just tack welds. How can you improperly tack weld? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, Home Depot. <laughs> I'm gonna get first. Just in case. Oh, sold out. Bro, is she taller than you? Hell no. Bro, why she got cool as bars? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> so, right now, I'm gonna be cutting these pieces right here, and uh, I've measured them out already, so they're all marked up. Um, I might have to cut four of them. So next thing, I'm gonna jig up the, uh, essentially the top piece. This is essentially gonna be the lower portion, and then this, whenever it's built out, is gonna connect to the top of this, and then I'm gonna measure out for the bottom piece. So I need to use this bottom side as a reference to uh, the angle of where the sides come out of the front, if that makes sense. Um, you'll see. <laughs> 